Welcome back to the Maniacs Club, buds! Hell yeah. We just got finished freeing a Lingberg. A big old whale. That was pretty cool. Pretty awesome. And now I need to drink my cafe. And that's some good stuff. Alright, so now we're going to go off to the next one. <clears throat> we need to go here. Mystic Gates. Are we off to find that Elven Sanctum then, or something else? We certainly can. Though we do have something else that needs our attention. We found a Hofgoofer out in the Barrens, my lady. In terrible pain. We freed it, but there's another in turn somewhere beneath the Forbidden Signs. A Hofgoofer? I haven't seen one since I was a child. What? And what else? There's still that secret elven library in Alfheim. I'm with you. Oh, man. Looks like we'll just be... Freaking going from place to place again. Appreciate it. If I don't have it, you don't need it. Yes. Just checking in on me? Yes, Mamir. I mean. See if we can go there now. You know what? Actually, what is that? Oh, bats. Cool. Now let's go back. You know what? Side mission. Let's go back to these, to this place, because they were. Always wonder why was Freya so revered here so quickly upon his first arrival. Well, to begin they kicked with, my ass it wasn't his last first time. arrival. Very few know this, but Freyr was one of the earliest visitors to Alfheim, back in the dawn of realm travel. Oh, a bit before my time. You tell. We believed for a long time that all the giants had died in the flood, until one of them appeared in Vanaheim. Her name was Gerda, and she came offering to teach us the secrets of traveling between realms using Bifrost light. Freyr became immediately infatuated with her. He always yearned to wander, and along came someone who could truly show him how. So, wander they did, exploring the world tree from root to branch. But one day, it came time for Gerd to wander away. Freyr was heartbroken and resolved himself to perform some great feat to win her back. He set his aim on the grandest of gestures. He intended to be the first to find the elusive source of Bifrost light. And he succeeded, although quite by accident. Freyr believed he navigated best while fortified by a potent blend of Vanir herbs. When he wandered, he wandered. And he managed to wander from the World Tree directly into the Lake of Souls. The Elves have never seen anybody come out of the lake before, so it got some attention. Oh, that is bloody hilarious. I don't know whether he worked his charms at that point or they just assumed him to be a great deity. But of course, he hadn't made this journey in search of responsibility, so he didn't stick around long. Still, the legend of his manifestation was passed along through the ages. It even endured after the Great Division, remembered by Light and Dark Elf alike. So when at last he returned, he was uniquely situated to gain the trust of both sides and help to create a truce. Big story. The problem was, both sides trusted only him. So the peace could only last as long as he stayed around to keep it. And with the long war dragging on without an end in sight, I suppose making any kind of peace was an irresistible notion for him. Even if it meant having to rule. Much of the sand has been cleared away, but another storm rages beyond that pass, which must mean... Another half gufa. A half gufa? Yeah. 
Yes, but first. <laughs> Let me pick this up. We'll come back over here. First, I need to beat these people up. I was once afraid, but not anymore. Oh yeah, buddy. Scroll. What's that? A diagram for a sword hilt. Perhaps. These pages are very old. It could be anywhere. It's like the relics outlined in these diagrams are very powerful. Pages one to four. Find the lost pages of the tomb. We have found pages torn from an ancient tomb. Pages contain diagrams of long forgotten sword hilts. We find these ingredients. I believe the dwarves can craft these relics once again. You can show it to one of the dwarves. Yes. They'll know what to do with it. Hell yeah! <laughs> Gauntlets of Radiance. Oh, level four. Eh. It's okay. Me just beating them is all I needed. It's all I need is rooms. New lore. Though it now serves as a military outpost, this, t uh, this tower's ar architecture indicates a different function, a different function in the time before the division of the light and dark. I can find no mention within the archives, which is al not altogether unusual. Many of the texts have been sanitized across generations, but the very absence of any information is telling in and of itself what sacrilegious ceremonies we were were held here so amicable amical to our current status quo that the librarians eradicated all mention of the tower's true purpose i can't help but to assume the answer is the key to a lasting peace the council sweet <laughs> Hell yeah! Got that bad boy. I got this right. Yeah. Nothing else over here. Huh?
What is there? The cave? Nope. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Oh, I see a bird. beat these people back up what is that noise y'all heard that right Yeah, boy. Come here. Oh my god. Want some? Last one. Oh yeah. Look at that. Just need a little bit of loving. Just need a little bit of loving. <laughs> Lore markers, twenty of twenty-five. I just love a good lore marker. Just think of how many, how long it took to sculpt and write the story on each one. Well, I've no one reads them though. Oh please, read as many as you can so the story lives on. Nice. Ah. I didn't mean to use it. I swear I did it. So you just refuse to pick a favorite poem. That's uncharacteristically indecisive of Well, office. I have a favorite poem. Look around you, oh God. Turn your head. Guide your metal friend with care. Or else it'd be dead. Rescue its friends. Experience tension. Immerse yourself in a new dimension. Ready. One from my homeland. <laughs> Oh, cool. Temporary slows down enemies. Cool. But it's not as strong as stuff I got already. <clears throat> I think that was it. I'm going to do a full circle around this area and then I'm going to go in the center.
Man, we got a whole bunch of stuff I need to find still. So. Huh. And that over here. Yeah, we just came from there. Take a left. We'll go in the center in a minute. <clears throat> Do a full circle. Oh, look. Totally missed this one. Jeez. Totally missed that one. I don't know how I did. I've killed many uh, surfaces. There is up, undoubtedly more down below in the dark elves hooves, hovels. So long as we deny them across our light, the pair of the desert's entrance shall remain the only docile version of the foul beasts. Let them remain. They will serve as useful subjects for further light infusion experimentation. The maven. Ooh. That's not good. What am I supposed to do here? Uh oh, is this supposed to be like unlock like enemies and stuff? Are these like uh special bosses? Definitely a special boss area. And I've been here. Have I been here? I think I have. Maybe. Let's slowly make our way down here and find out. Of course it had to have been the slowest route. Oh yeah, I've been here. We gotta go up. Yeah, I remember when I was leaving, I seen this one area.
Okay, so... Come on. Oh, got it. The apple. Freaking apple, dude. I'm so glad I came back here. I am so glad I came back here. But there was nothing else over here, so it's time to go. I get that hack silver, boys. Can't, for Can't forget about that hack silver. What is moaning? There should be no moaning because I released him. That was totally worth it. What is this? Have I been in here? Funny how you he let her through first, but sort of a harp. I can play beautifully, you know. I do not. I would prefer a mini harp. Unplayable, of course. Likely meant to reflect Friar's musical skill. Sad that it's stringed. It said that with a stringed instrument in his hand and a song on his lips, there is nothing he couldn't accomplish. No virgin too chaste, chaste no warrior too wraithful. I'd like to imagine Freyr uh, was small enough to not resort to song and dance when it came to bro brokering a peace between the elves. That's what I like to imagine anyways. It remained that way. Missing something. <laughs> nice. Just had to freaking be Mr. Smart. Shield Ron with the power of unleashed for further ruin upon the cursed enemy. Eh, it's okay. Consume the ailment, causing a damage elemental explosion. Ooh, shield strike. Double tap L1 against the status effect enemies. Consume the ailment, causing damage elemental explosion. Hmm. That's cool. Oh. 
Had to smash you smash. I'm oh my god. I'm like the worst. Whenever we get inside. I wonder. This is where that one guy was at. Make sure I got him. He's gotten. He done been gotten. Hell yeah. We whooped that bote. Can we get down there? This ain't Elden Ring. Or is that where that guy came from? The Hofgufa. Oh yeah, we're clearing this whole bad boy out. No entrance. I get a snot. this place out. I'm almost done. We are almost done here. Oh, we are done. Just gotta go to the entrance now. Woohoo! If we can. Regardless, we're done Come here. Come on, brother. Let's have it. You mentioned you had a favorite poem from your homeland. What was it about? A cunning general. A war over forbidden love. What? I believe I've heard of this one. Did it involve a horse that was not as it appeared? Yes. But that is not what happened. Oh, it's based on truth then. And you were there. Yes. Nice. I prefer the poem. Oh. Nice. It's as though the light elf sealed off this section of the barrens. Why? Luckily for us, a very considerate goddess has enhanced our magic chisel, and we can unseal it. Hell well, yeah. That is lucky. The forbidden sands lay beyond. Contested territory, according to Bela, and another storm to endure. 
Let's freaking go! Glowy lizard. Any birds? Oh, I'm still looking for your birds. I remember when Freya and I traveled to this realm as children. The desert was healthy and full of life back then. I can't help but fear that era has ended for good in our efforts here. Futile. Ooh. It's a fair concern. Healing this land will take more than a pair of singing half -gifa. But I have to believe in the long run, we're doing right by Alfheim. Oh, I, I bet you are. Just like when you thought you was doing right by locking up that big old whale. We start looking for a way underground. Keep the lookout for a cave. What? This looks so dangerous. How do you, how do you go past it? How do you get in there? How do you get in there? Might have to clear the, the storm. That's awesome that they follow you. That's so cool. I didn't see that one and I ran it over. One of them. Oh, there's another one. Can I reach it? Will you let me reach it? third one at right up there oh 
Oh! What? That's how it's done, son. That's how you do it, man. Oh, hell yeah. Totally worth it. That's what daddy needs. Yeah, the entrances are all closed up. The other hop goofa must be under there. I was about to say, don't don't leave without me, man. Do you get in here? I see an entrance. Nice. Let's freaking go. Get out of this damn storm. I hope Freyr will appreciate our work here in the desert. I wonder if he knows how poorly this realm has fared in his absence. Aye. Hearing the song of the sands again is a rare privilege. Even if it's only a solo act. For a duet, once this hop goofa is free. <clears throat> Ooh. White and dark elves. This architecture. It is not of the dark elves. An abandoned ancient settlement by the looks of it. Built long before the Lightwell's creation. More hive matter as well. I'd say we're on the right track then. Let's go here for. Oh, no. Never mind. Never mind. So much death. Oh. Let's go deeper. No oh, hacks over. You old hack silver. Oh, what's that? Zippity doo da, zippity. From down here. This kind of hive material is sensitive to sound. How odd. That was weird. When I last came here with you and Atreus, I assumed the absence of Alfheim's light was an aberration. I didn't realize it was covered by hive mother. Aye. And as far as the Dark Elves are concerned, it's that light column in the center of the temple that's the aberration. 
Just look at how old some of these surfaces are. Far older than the light well, or even our trapped half giver for that matter. That's quite the innovative perspective, Mimir. Well, dangle from a burly god's Whoa. backside for a few winters, and you'll find yourself looking for all sorts of new perspectives. That dude's dead. Dead. Wee. More hive, but denser. Wow, well, there you go. Pretty cool. Let's free this half goofa. Enemies to your left. Oh, they're level fours. Oh, this is gonna be kind of hard. Think so, man. Ow. Oh, got him. Some of them are level twos. Oh, shanked them in the gut a couple of times. Travel underneath the barrens, do they? Territory changes hands often in Nalfheim, or so it appears. Big Theo did mention that these ruins have historical significance for the Light Elves. I assume they're only here to keep intruders out. Well, at least they tried. I came over here. Okay. What does this say, Mamir? I suspect the corpse below would disagree. Corpse lay below this one. I wonder if he, the, the poor soul wrote it before it expired, or if it said it was written by a friend who caused, caused said expiration. No sacrifice in vain. Yeah, that's not good. Oh. 
Okay, why can't I? Is it? Let's squeeze through it. Must be a Is the man? <laughs> Dwarven steel, bunch of hex over. That's a good haul. Oh, another one, and another one. Continue, shall we? Thank you. Spider-Man in it. <laughs> Trying to figure out where the hell... Where else am I supposed to go? Die, you vile creature! Behind you, brother! boy oh who took his head off no you don't no you don't boy I hope freeing these hot goofas will allow them to breed again it was a dazzling display once the skies of Alfheim filled with their song. I imagine it's the lack of fresh life that's caused this pair to grow abnormally large. No use in having babies if there's nothing for them to feed on. Trying to protect their children from the harsh world. I can relate. <coughs> <coughs> Oh, you can relate, huh? Too bad you didn't do a good job. Oh, dude. That's cold.
easy. Hold on. Yeah, but, uh, anything down below? No. All right. I wonder if these two comprehend the choice they face once free. What choice do you speak of? The life cycle of the Hafgufa. In order to breed, they must pass on their light to their children. And without light, they will die. I suppose that's all any of us can hope for in the end. Dale. That our death has purpose. That we can live on through our children. Well, given another chance, I know what choice I would make. There's some toilet stone. Interesting. What am I missing?
What am I missing? Why is it not working? All these angles are really bad. Good. Almost there. Oh, now we can do it. I'm so smart, I know. Oh, what the hell? He's free, free as the bird. Hi, back to the surface then. That was easy. Oh no, was that another entrance? Oh. Yeah, baby. Crack that skull and take you home. You coming with daddy. A fight. Used in many of Freyr's blessings, I imagine. Sweet. Whispering slab. Massive fiery Huh? Oh my god.
Rampage of Furies. A lot of damage. What do we have for skills? How much is that? 1700. 1500. Target enemy during its attack with Scorch significantly increases damage dealt. Ooh. Oh. Just one. Good enough. downstairs oh, almost missed it almost missed that one We didn't miss it though, because we're awesome. The fate of these creatures reminds me of a story. Does it? There once was a blacksmith whose king commanded him to construct a box that could contain all the evils of the world. But no metal could hold such a power. So the blacksmith used the flame. Kratos, is this a story meant to ease my grief? Perhaps it is just a story. Way to pass the time. <laughs> I appreciate the sentiment, but, well, your stories. What about my stories? I wouldn't exactly call them a comfort. Fair. Mamir is the better storyteller. Oh my god. Don't sell yourself short, brother. You've come a long way from the days of laconic fables. <laughs> it's okay. Finish your story, Kratos. The blacksmith's daughter was the key to unlocking the box. He died trying to protect her from those who would open it. Well, at least it's a relatable story. <laughs> That's funny. Stonewood? I'm so good. God, zero seven? Got like nothing out of this one. All right. Years we've overstayed our welcome in our time. That was a close one. 
That was a closer. I could have went sideways real quick. Okay, just forbidden sands in general. Now let's unleash the beast. The sand and complete. Are of no comfort. Take solace. Lore complete. We have discovered that source of the sandstorm creature. Oh, okay, Hafka files have been released and the sandstorm in the deserts have subsided. Once reunited, they made it, gave birth, and died. Their species will live on. I am pleased we were able to free them. And that I was able to spend the time to, with those who are close to me. These creatures offer a reminder of the time. Reminder that the time we have with our loved ones is short and never guaranteed. I will remember this moment fondly. Oh, that's so awesome! Did what you thought was best for your son's safety. What? Look at that! Little choice for a parent. Look at that! Yay! And now neither are they. That's awesome. That's so awesome. Look at that. Oh. Incredible. The song of the sands. Well, wow. didn't know I could get misty. It's beautiful. Is that there sperm all going Thank all over the place? This land sings once more. We've done good here. Big time. What the fuck? No rush to leave yet, is that? They Who end up straight kind of up dying. Us in a freshly lit balance. Oh, look at the babies. Oh, they're everywhere. Oh, what the hell? That's so cool. Look at that, guys. Wow. That is super awesome. The little sperm babies are all over in the air. <laughs> it looks so cool, man. What the flip? This is super cool, guys. I'll end this episode right here. This is a good... Oh, man. This is a good spot to stop at. Oh, God. It's so cool. Aw. We helped them th to thrive on. The Hawk... The Hawk Goofas will survive another millennia. Look at that, man. So cool, guys. I hope you enjoyed that episode. If you did, hit that like button, guys. Catch you on the flip side. Peace.